Hey guys and welcome to another video of Spark Plug. So in this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to make these Superman rings. Actually, I I, I saw them on internet and decided to make them. Uh, so I tried making them. Uh, I have not uh, assumed any dimension. Uh, all the dimension is being taken as randomly. So hope you guys will enjoy the video. So let's get started. So uh, first start by making a rectangle at front plate draw a rectangle of any size and then go to sketch dimension and give it its uh, the dimension of 30 by 7 the longer uh, side will be of 30 mm the center and again the shorter one will be of 7 and the distance from the origin to the lowermost line will be uh, 25 yeah 25 and press ok now we have to revolve it around this axis so just go to create go to revolve click on this as the profile now select the axis as the blue one and press ok go to new component and press ok now once done what we have to do is go to create and no, no, no. go to modify go to chamfer select this edge and this edge and uh, make sure the chamfer type is selected as the two distance two distance no actually we will do one by one so just select this and it will ask you the two distance so the vertical one will be of eight make this eight and the horizontal one this one will be of four, five so once done you press ok and repeat the same on the other edge also go to chamfer two distances this one will be 8 the horizontal one and the vertical one will be 5 and just press ok now once done what we have to do is go to modify go to press pull select the inner face and just extrude cut towards out with the uh, distance of minus 2 minus 2 and just press ok once done you can you see that we have a sharp edge here so just make some fillet here just click on this edge and this edge and make a fillet off a little fillet will work actually I forget what what was the value of fillet at that yeah the, the fillet radius will be of 0 0.5 mm and just press ok now you can see that the outer part of the ring has been completed now we have to make just this superman logo so for that we are going to use the svg icon if you just go to insert command you can see there's an option for insert svg so svg icons are those file which acts as a sketch they act as a sketch when you are when you insert them on any plane so i have downloaded a svg icon from flatty icons flat icons.com uh, you can get it for free uh, they are absolutely free you can go to just the flat icons.com and you can just search the superman there are various kind of uh, icons choose whatever you want any scan you can uh, impose any type of icon they have lakhs of uh, millions of icons so you just download this and make sure uh, you have selected as svg now note it is in svg format and what we have to do is uh, we have to construct a plane at uh, tangent plane so select this uh, uh, the angle is not required just a plane is required now the next step is to offset this plane uh, offset this plane uh, to any distance and just delete the previous plane you have we have just created just delete it by selecting in and press delete key deleting now go to select sketch and click on the off oh, uh, offset plane that we have just created now we have to insert the svg icon that we have just downloaded so go to insert go to svg it will ask you about the file as we are in uh, uh, the file is here superman.svg and just press ok now you can see that here's the superman we have to adjust it accordingly so just lower its size uh, i'm gonna place it in middle of the origin somewhere here actually let me just switch over to the environment to the photo booth 
so that will uh, be more easy for you guys to see little board yeah you just place it in the middle and just press ok now after placing you can see we have to extrude it through the face so extrude it click on the profile uh, select this profile and to start click on from object it will ask you the object from which you want it to get extruded so select this face and it will then if you extrude it you can see that it is being extruded from that face so the extruded distance will be very low so that it may act as a face so extruded distance i have decided to do as 0.001 mm and just press ok wait for your system to respond now